Hey everybody, it's been a long time coming. Happy Friday. I'm about to watch the trailer for the next step, season 9. B expectations going into this. I've literally just finished watching episode 11 and it was left on the cliffhanger that they need to get rid of a dancer. My idea was to get rid of Kenzie because she's going to be in France this whole time anyway. She's not going to be in any of the dances um, or it wouldn't be smart to put her in any of the dances. So I'm guessing she'd be the alternate. So just get rid of her and then she can still go with them and just cheer them on. But that would be who I got rid of. In terms of the second half of the series, obviously I'm, ex I'm expecting internationals. I would love for Freya Sky to pop up in this um, trailer. Freya Sky was the UK Junior Eurovision entry for 2023, 22. But yeah, we've got the trailer and everyone has been saying how insane it is. So here we go. The opening shot is of this person in a dress and I do not know what this is about. Frame by frame, guys, let's do this. If you're watching this as a live premiere, get your fingers on your keyboard and join in talking with me. Right, opening shot, I don't know who it is still. Then we've got Ethan in Studio One looking absolutely fabulous. He's even got heels on. I am loving this. Like Ethan's gloves solo that he did as an audition for A-Troop um, when he used the gloves as a prop, which I know wasn't really a prop, I have highlighted this. I do think he could have done something else and should have done something else and he should have been called out for it, but loved it and I love the energy and I love that he's able to embrace this style. Ariana is tearful doing a solo. Then we have Adele and Anthony doing a duet. I'm gonna say that's just a duet, like a recreational let's dance about our feelings duet. Then there's someone in black. Is it Pascal? I've, I've done it frame by frame. It looks a little bit like Pascal, so it could be. Um, then Grace and Ariana are having a confrontation. Then somebody has planted Daisy's bow staff in Ariana's locker. I'm going to guess it's Grace. Maybe Ariana said, I don't want to be evil anymore. And Grace has said, you know, you're, you, you have to be. Or, yeah, fine. But then she's going to try and set her up instead. So she's hidden the bow staff in her locker. Because it wasn't in there before. Ariana's opened her locker before and it wasn't in there. And I love how the both staff's coming back because I did say, have, where actually is it? Then we have Ebby and Niall doing a duet. I've said I would love it if they were doing a duet for internationals. So I wouldn't be mad at that. Or it could be another duet about feelings, but they have already just done a wreck duet. So I don't know. Someone filed an anonymous complaint against the next step. Someone's filed a complaint against the next step. I'm going to say it's Grace. Like just to get them in even more trouble, just keep all these things going on in the background. But Anthony just did a solo, love that, because I love Anthony's dance style. We've got Jet and Pete doing a duet. That could be for internationals or a rec duet. I don't know, I'm excited for all these dances. Who would do this? Grace. We take down the Mad King and reclaim our realm. Are they slowly trying to, like, uh, are they starting to put it together? And Izzy's like, come on, we've got to do this and take them down. Or this is just an excerpt from a scene and Izzy's just talking about like a show that they've watched and everyone's like, I have no clue what you're talking about, Izzy. I have this secret that I've been keeping since I got here and it's eating me alive. I have no clue what Pascal's secret is though, because what could it be? Can you leave your ideas for what you think Pascal's secret is? Because obviously no one's seen it at this point, so I'm open to all ideas and suggestions. Leave them in the comments. Type them live right now if you're watching the premiere. If not, leave them in the comments. I will read them. Pascal, nice dance outfit. The entire team's international's future is resting on me. Are these the contenders for the international solo? Olive, Anthony, Ebby and Ethan? Because I'm down for that, but I would also like to see Heath up there. I think I'd quite like it to be Ethan, you know? Anthony's just a safe option for me, but I'd love it to be Ethan. Do you have any idea what you're doing? Do you have any idea what you're doing? What? Is Anthony dance captain now? Maybe Ariana steps down as dance captain? I love authoritative Eldon, by the way. Maybe Anthony tries to choreograph or overrule Eldon? <gasps> Kenzie! Who is this lady with Kenzie? We have a date. Remy and Ebby have a date? Yes? Wait, why are Pascal and Heath on each of her shoulders? And Pascal lives in France. Unless you're gonna move to France, Heath. This isn't gonna work, is it? It's okay to put yourself first. Who is this person with Kenzie? She's French. But why would she come to the next step just to be her friend? Maybe she's come to get Pascal. But why would she come? Because you've got to think like she would have paid for a plane ticket. Think of the team, Kenz. I always think of the team. Oh, okay. Maybe Pete thinks that Kenzie should be kicked off. Because that's what I thought. 
and is like, think of the team, Kens, which I am thinking. Or maybe she's like, right, I need to be in every single routine for internationals. And Pete's like, internationals is tomorrow. Think of the team, Kens. Something like that. Miss Michelle! Michelle is back. Queen. Then why have you got like this Friends themed dance? That's cute. But Pascal was still there then. So I'm guessing Pascal and Kenzie are going to stay in the other countries for quite a while. Then we've got Team France again with the dancer. So it's definitely a dancer from Team France, if you didn't guess by the accent. Maybe the dance captain? I don't know. What's that? Oh, that's the internationals trophy. It looks broken. Why are the French team in Studio A? Do the sister studios go to each other and it's all just a live stream? Dance for it! Oh my god, Heath and Ariana. That's a big hug. Heath, keep your wits about you, bro. And these are costumes for internationals because they're very basic. And I hate that some of us have long sleeves and some of us have short sleeves. There should be one rule unless there's two groups. Oh, have you got another prom? I would love a prom. We have got another prom by the looks of it. Ah! And that's Olive. Olive looks so cute. Everyone looks cute. I'm gonna guess if France does have to come over to Canada and comes to the next step, they have like a prom night where they get to know each other and just chill. That'd be so lovely. And I'd love it as well if Eldon and Michelle are both there for it and Emily, but I don't know if Emily will come back. And cause obviously in series six, Michelle and Eldon were both at the prom. Eldon can DJ again. Michelle can be her lovely self in pink. Miles, burgundy is your colour, bro. French dancer and Kenzie again, but I'm guessing this will be like towards the start of series 9B and Kenzie's like, oh, I can't wait to go back home. And this dancer's like, oh, I'd love to come and see the next step or something like that. It's nice that we're seeing Kenzie in France though. And, and Ethan and mystery dancer, are we getting a boy and a boy relationship? Please, I would love that. Because obviously we've had Jude and Cleo has that been our only same-sex relationship? I think so. As in like, new gen. I would love that for Ethan. This is like Ethan's series, so please. Grace looks stunning as per as well. Everyone looks stunning. We are in big trouble. Who let you in here? Who let you in here? Well, Grace is already there. Ariana's there. Who else don't we like? Maybe Pascal? Because Pascal is not in his prom scene, so maybe Pascal's secret is something that's really detrimental. Because Heath was sad in the locker room, right? So maybe if Heath likes Pascal and they have a, like a bonding sesh, but then Pascal says her secret and Heath is like, that is too bad of a secret for me to continue liking you. So he's sad. And then Pascal comes back? Or is Lucian or Maria back maybe? Okay, then we've got international shots. Everyone stop. Ariana. Is Ariana our soloist? And you know what? She's giving me Brian Olay vibes. I'm still hanging on to the thread that Rochelle might be back, but Ariana looks great. Then we have this group routine, right? And I'm guessing this is Team France because I don't know anyone in it. And that guy in the middle looks like the guy that was talking to Ethan, but this person on the left looks a lot like Kenzie. Either Kenzie's doing a summer and helping Team France in their time of need, like she did to Acro Nation, or something's happening. And also, is this our internationals? Like, are we just having the two teams compete against each other and then we don't see anybody else? If so, very, very sad. But if they do it well, I'm not going to hate it that much because obviously the budget is less. I am completely in understanding of that. But if they do it well and it's not just terrible, it might be fine. Okay, they're at the next step. This is literally the next step. The windows are there. So France and Canada are competing at the next step and they're gonna live stream it is that the vibe then that's kate roman defo we know how kate does her barrel roll so is she a soloist because that's a different costume to the blue one so i'm gonna say the blue one might be a group routine or a small group or a trio or something and this is her solo this doesn't look like tns oh my god olive olive is in a long dress so it's olive at the start right so this is the start of the group number isn't it this shot of olive in the spotlight and then when everyone else has got the waistcoats on, that is everybody else's costume. One thing that I've noticed now though, in this group shot, right, there are two people not in costume. One of them looks like Ebby and the other one is definitely Olive. So is Ebby gonna be our alternate? And I'm guessing Olive is just in that dress ready. So maybe it's a secret. So she's kind of covering up her costume. But remember, we had to get rid of one team member also. Anthony Kenzie, is he 
Adele, Olive, Ariana, Jet, Ebby. I think this is Pete's mouth here. <laughs> Ethan, Heath, Niall. Oh my God. And I haven't seen any pictures of Niall at internationals. We are going to cut Niall, I think. And then Ebby will be the alternate. Oh my God. Adele and Anthony have the duet. Not sure how I feel about that. And I also am not vibing with Adele's costume. So I'm hoping that's not... Maybe it's a twist and suddenly they have to pick someone else, but I'm not vibing with it. Heathcliff! Heathcliff as a bird! How exciting, everybody! Buzzing. Six o'clock, the brand new episode. It takes two to tango. And the description is, with the internationals fast approaching, the new dance captain faces a huge decision. Okay? So that's on at six o'clock. It's on in an hour from when I am posting this. So I will be reacting to it. And my reaction will be up on Sunday. I cannot wait. Um, let me know if you're excited for series nine and what you think is going to happen. I don't have anything else to say. I've pinpointed it all. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment down below, subscribe as well. And I will see you tomorrow, tomorrow, Sunday for another video. Or if you're not watching these in order and you're watching them whenever you like, or maybe way off into the future, I'll see you when I next see you. I hope you enjoyed the video. Goodbye.